Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on The Flash Season 6. Today we're going to be talking about the first look promo photos for Episode 1. We're going to be breaking down these photos. They've released a bunch of them. Not too many, but still enough to talk about and to get very much so excited about. Also, we've got a title reveal for one specific upcoming episode. And so we'll be talking about that all and more in this video. So if you do go on to enjoy the video... Please be sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DCTV videos later this year. Okay, so let's talk about these photos. So this is coming from TV Line and they've released five new photos for episode one. Obviously, by now all we've had is really Comic Con where the cast and the crew, so that being the new showrunner, Eric Wallace, they've talked about the show, they've teased what's going to come. I've done a video on, you know, everything we know so far, and so that video basically covers what we've been told prior to, you know, us getting new trailers and new photos and stuff like this. And so finally, we've got our first new piece of news since basically Comic Con. I'm talking about, like, actual visual news rather than just, you know, casting or whatever. So this is very exciting. We've got our first look photos at episode one, which is actually titled Into the Void which I don't think it's any specific reference, but I think it's probably relating to the monitor because we know the monitor's probably going to show up in episode one. He was at the table reading way back, you know, about a month ago, just before Comic-Con, he was at the table reading. We know he's been shooting some scenes. He's done some face molding recently. If you check out La Monica Garrett's Instagram stories, he posts quite a lot to do with Crisis and everything that's happening. So he's going to pop up regularly, and I think Into the Void is a reference to what's going to be happening with him and what's going to happen with the approaching crisis that's coming. So this is the first photo right here. This is in the hallway of Star Labs. You see Grant as Barry Allen, who is happy and smiling. And I believe this could be right after where we ended with Barry and Iris, you know, I believe, well, I haven't watched the episode in, you know, a few months or so, but they ended when Iris and him were inside the vault and they actually got that message, that nice message from Nora before the end of the season. And so, yeah, he's smiling, he's happy. It seems like all is pretty much well for now, but then I predict this is going to lead into what we get in our next photo. And this next photo is inside the vault, the time vault. And obviously you see reverse flashes, a sort of cage in the background where his suit was originally. And if you look carefully at the facial expressions of Iris and also Barry, there is an expression of fear and sort of shock. And if you remember the Comic Con trailer, I would recommend you go back and watch it to remind what roughly is going to be happening in episode one. Although it doesn't give too much away, it gives you a few specific shots that's going to be going down. We know there was a shot inside the time vault with Barry and that is going to probably be happening in this scene. And so it seems like he is getting a message and it won't be Nora's message. So I believe it's going to continue on from where the season ended and that specific post credit scene was actually the 2019 crisis being revealed. So I think after he is all happy and everything sort of reminiscing on... You know, the time's passed with Nora, and obviously he's a bit sad at the same time, but he's sort of happy, and he can sort of, you know, get, I guess move on, you know, for a little bit, and he's just sort of happy to be talking to Iris, I guess. And then, so they go in here, and you get the scene where they find out about the 2019 crisis that is coming much sooner, and that is when you get this face of shock on both of them. And, yeah, so just a nice photo as well. And very exciting to see some more Time Vault stuff. I always like these scenes. Okay, so let's move on to the next photo. The next photo, we've got Caitlin here, obviously played by Danielle, who's going to be directing an episode. Actually, episode six. She's actually preparing to do that right now. They're about to film that. But anyway, so this photo is of her. She's in Star Labs. She's got a Star Labs mug. It's just a normal day, you know, inside Star Labs. This is probably going to be early on in the episode it seems like she's listening to someone so perhaps she is listening to what Barry and Iris are saying and what they are telling everyone because of what they've seen in the time vault and perhaps this is a way for them to lead into the monitor 
where they have this, you know, brief encounter at the start of the episode. They find out about, you know, the article being 2019 now. It's been fast-tracked, and, you know, he reveals it to all of Team Flash. Maybe this photo's included in that. Maybe it's her just listening to them. And that's how you bring in the monitor, because they know of the impending crisis that is going to come extremely soon, and, you know, a lot sooner than expected. And then you have the monitor show up. I think that would make a lot of sense. Okay, so let's move on. Seems like this is, again, a kind of intense scene. Cisco is here, played by Carlos. You see in the background, you've got Candace as Iris. And it seems to be in the same specific place where Caitlin was in the last photo. The lighting is pretty much the same. And it seems like he's a bit confused. He's a bit upset, maybe a bit frustrated. And so I think... This is all, you know, the first three to four minutes or so of the episode, and this is the same interaction that you're getting in those other photos. And then we move on to this next one, and it's a bit confusing, this one, because you get this photo of all of Team Flash, and their expressions are very different. So you got Iris here on the far left. She's got a tablet, so she's showing something on the screen. So it seems like they are showing what is going to happen. And... So her facial expression is kind of smirking a little bit. Barry's got a little smile. And then moving on, you have Caitlin. And Danielle's face is kind of in shock. It kind of looks like she's a bit perplexed or she's, uh, you know, reacting to something big. And then you have Carlos down there, very much so in the same clothes, the same position. So Caitlin's also holding the mug. So they are, you know part of the same scene you have iris in the same wear so it seems like this is right after whatever iris and barry have found out in the time vault so i do believe they are showing you know the 2019 article to them so carlos's reaction is sort of you know kind of normal just a normal face no real expression and then in the background you have hartley obviously playing ralph and he's got sort of like a smirk as well so it's a bit confusing but i think they are reacting to the 2019 crisis article because it's changed and I think the reason why Barry's actually kind of smiling he's got his mouth open so I think he's actually talking in this specific scene sort of explaining what's going on and yeah so that is the photos I'm very excited for episode one titled Into the Void and this is coming very soon obviously in October we are really close to the next trailer and the next trailer should come in the next week or so, maybe a little promo. I think, you know, normally every year they do a DCTV sort of joint promo where they, you know, debut the first a couple of seconds of footage from all the different shows. So maybe that's coming out. That actually comes out, you know, normally annually around this exact day. So maybe be on the lookout for that. But also we should have some episode one promos coming out very soon for the rest of the shows. Okay, so let's move on. So the next piece of news we've got from The Flash is episode four will be titled There Will Be Blood. And so this is really interesting. There Will Be Blood, the title is a reference to Paul Thomas Anderson's film, There Will Be Blood. And I don't think it's anything specific to do with the film but just the fact that it's a cool title, it works with what's going on, and the reason why it works with what's going on, because what is going on is the villain for the first part of the season, graphic novel number one, as Eric Wallace says, is actually blood work. And what is blood work all about? Blood. And what is the title called? There Will Be Blood. It's a nice reference to a film name, but also it really works with the character. So I think this is going to be a heavy blood work episode, perhaps an origin episode, or perhaps they're just going to sort of delve into the blood making that is going to happen because the title is There Will Be Blood, therefore you can infer there's going to be blood coming very soon. So yeah, it's a very nice title, I really like it, so I'm very excited for all of this. Let me know, are you in the comments down below? Also please be sure to leave a like and subscribe, turn on notifications to not miss any videos. So I'll catch you guys later. Goodbye.
see you.